An update now on a story we brought to you in April. As you may remember, four horses were being abused in the Havasupai Nation as they were taking tourists down into the Grand Canyon. Last spring, they were brought to the Coconino Humane Association for rehabilitation. Since then, three of those horses have been adopted, but one is still being treated for its wounds. We, have re we recently went out to see how the, horses, or how the horse has been doing, and as today, Sierra Shipley reports. Meet Brownie. He was severely malnourished. The worst of the four horses rescued, he was almost 600 pounds underweight when he arrived. Uh, usually horses are between anywhere from 9 to 1,100 pounds. Along with being underweight, caretaker Lakin Minnick says Brownie has lost sight in his right eye. And then on his left eye, he has the beginnings of bad cataracts. It looks a little milky, but not nearly as bad as the right eye. Despite those injuries, he has been steadily recovering over the past six months and is almost ready to move on. He has put on complete full weight. I mean, he's not, his ribs aren't showing anymore. He is starting to get back uh, his health. I would say he's not all the way recovered, but if you had to do percentage wise, it's anywhere between 80 to 90%. The last 10% is because of a cyst on his side that spread to the bone. We thought we had gotten it completely drained, but over the course of six months, it's come back. And that led us to believe that there's more of an infection and that it's deeper than where it was originally. Once Brownie heals completely, he will be looking for a loving home. Best homes for these animals would be either a sanctuary or a home where they can be, you know, basically a buddy for another horse. They're not going to be able to be rode again. Sierra Shipley, NAZ Today. If you would like to donate to help Brownie, you can by calling the shelter or visiting their GoFundMe page for Horses Animal Cruelty Case.